Assalamualaikum Good day everyone How are you guys doing? Today For unit 1 We are going to learn about Punctuations Here are the learning standards For today's lesson Today We are going to look into 6 punctuations Number 1 Full stop Titik A full stop is placed at the end of a complete sentence Titik diletakkan di hujung ayat yang lengkap For example My name is Mimi Full stop I am 12 years old Full stop I love to sing while listening to music Full stop Number 2 Comma A comma is used to separate phrases or items in a list Koma digunakan untuk memisahkan frasa atau item di dalam senarai For instance Mimi ate a burger a bowl of salad, an ice cream, and a donut. A comma is also used after introductory words and phrases. Comma juga digunakan selepas kata penghantar. For instance, firstly, suddenly, unfortunately, one day, later, at the end of the day, I was completely exhausted. Before the movie starts, let's get some popcorn. Number 3. Question mark. Tanda soal. A question mark is placed at the end of a sentence when asking a question. Tanda soal diletakkan di hujung ayat apabila kita menanyakan soalan. For example, What is your name? How old are you? Why are you late? Number 4. Capital letter. Huruf besar. A capital letter is used to begin a sentence in proper nouns and in direct speech huruf besar digunakan di awal ayat pada kata nama khas dan juga dalam perbualan Mia Adrina is my best friend she lives in Kuala Kangsa Perak it is better late than never he said Number 5 Exclamation mark Tanda seru An exclamation mark is used to express strong feelings or emotion Tanda seru digunakan untuk menunjukkan perasaan atau emosi yang kuat For example Stop! Let's go! You did a great job! Number 6 Quotation mark Tanda pengikat kata A quotation mark is used in a sentence or question to indicate speech or conversation Tanda pengikat kata digunakan di dalam ayat atau soalan untuk menunjukkan ucapan atau perbualan For example Why are you late? Ask Mimi I have a lot of work to do, said Jimmy. Now, it's time for practice. Please refer to your English textbook, page 6. There are two tasks that you need to complete. Please complete the tasks in E1. All the best! That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Bye.